The following program was produced by students from Drexel University's Department of Cinema and Television. For more information, visit drexel.edu slash westfall. Yo, Brian, you forgot some stuff. Look, if you just wait, I'd help you. Look, okay, thanks, man, but I got it, okay? And you look really good today. <laughs> thanks. What? That smells, that's bad. It's, it's fine. You know, just go back inside, okay? It's, it's not fine. It's bad. Go inside. Bad. You look ridiculous. Oh, it's bad. Hey, Brian. How are you? Uh, not too bad. Thanks. What's going on over here? You, my friend, are wearing a skirt. Kilt. I'm catering a Scottish festival, hence the kilt. You know what they say. Real men wear skirts. Kilt. Uh, what are you making? It smells interesting. Oh, well, um, actually we've got some kidney pie. <laughs> uh, and then you've got your bacon and cabbage over there. And then you've got crew beans, which are um, boiled pig's feet. And then haggis, sheep's stomach. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Tastes pretty good too. Hey, hey, do you want to try some? Oh no, I, I already oh, ate. Nonsense, come on, one bite won't kill you. No, you know what, I'm doing a cleanse and Claire, I can't eat come on. anything. You're being ridiculous, Claire, come on, it's really good. Mmm. Fine. Mmm, good, right? Mm. I knew that you'd like it. <clears throat> you okay? Uh, Claire? Long day ahead of us, so eat up. What? The intern scavenger hunt. The most important day of the year. The winner gets an all-expense-paid trip to the medical expo and gets to shadow Dr. Terman, the chief. It's the opportunity of a lifetime. I'm going to win, and you are going to help me. Yeah. Well, hey, Felicia. You ready for the big day? <laughs> We're gonna leave in a few minutes, so. I just got finished four days of double shifts playing Betsy Ross. I'm not going anywhere. But don't talk to me, I'm not here. Oh my God, oh. oh hey Claire, you look nice. Oh, thanks. Oh, this looks great, I wish I could stay. What do you mean you wish you could stay? It's my court date with Brian, remember? I'm, I'm being sued, I, I have to go. Richard! Richard! I am sorry. Claire, I'm ready to go. Hey, thanks. You're supposed to help me with the scavenger hunt. Uh oh. <laughs> I offered to give Claire my legal counsel today. She really needs it. Yet I need you. This is a really serious legal matter. She could go bankrupt. What? You're not going to go bankrupt. She might go bankrupt. Plus, uh, this is a really big deal to me. This is like my first real case. It's a really big deal to me. Everything you need 
is in this binder, okay? It's a list of tasks, clues, just the whole thing is mapped out, okay? The whole operation. Consider this your boyfriend for today. Kinda jealous. Take my car keys. Take my car keys, take my car, drive around in it. You'll do great, okay? All right, bye, bye. Haley, thanks. We got this. Yeah, we'll take that. Ah, oh, there are words in here. I can read words. So, I'm gonna help you. You will? <gasps> no. As long as you do my laundry, have my Betsy Ross costume dry cleaned, and make me breakfast in bed for a month. Deal. Okay. All right, what's the first clue? In life and in death, I bridge the gaps. Come find my house, the work I'm known for flaps. Oh, God. What? It's the Betsy Ross house. Uber versus Kelly, report to room 417. You have the tiniest bladder in the world. I can't help it. I'm really nervous. I mean, I've never been sued before. Oh my God, I'm gonna throw up. Yeah, considering that's how we got here in the first place, that might not be the best idea. Richard! You've got the best lawyer around. The best law student, you mean? They don't know that. What? Oh my God. Claire, oh my God, it's gonna be okay. One? This is law school 101. We're gonna be in and out. Five minutes and then we'll go to brunch, okay? You promise? Promise. Doyle versus Hart, report to room 405. All right, here goes nothing. Stay calm. Okay. Yeah? Yes. Let's do it. Yeah, okay. So why do you have the keys anyways? I open up in the mornings. Does that mean people are gonna be here soon? No, we don't open till 11 on Tuesdays, but I don't wanna be here any longer than I have to. So Haley, please, what do we have to do so we can get out of here? Uh, we just have to prove that we were here. Okay. Well, there's a flag uh, right there, so. No. Take a photo. Anybody can get a picture of that flag. The Betsy Ross flag is in the exhibit right over here. <gasps> oh, can I take a picture? Oh, just be quiet. <gasps> Mr. Conway. Felicia. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here today. Uh, my friend Haley here needs to take pictures of the flag. Uh, her. it's for a scavenger hunt. The flag? Yeah. The Betsy Ross flag? Absolutely not. Nobody, but nobody takes picture of the Betsy Ross flag. Well, what are you doing here? Me? I, um, oh, um, pipe burst in the, uh, the thing in the water and a family of raccoons got in there last night and just made a huge mess. I'm, I was cleaning up all night. It was crazy. Honey, I'm waiting. Raccoons? Yeah. Family, a lot of girls. Haley, I don't think Mr. Conway is going to have a problem with you taking a picture of the Betsy Ross flag. Now, are you? Oh, oh that flag? No, 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 no. No, you can take it. Yeah, you're fine. Haley, is it? She hand sewed that. You know that? It's amazing. <laughs> it was a whiz with a needle. <laughs> How you doing? I don't think anybody really has to know about this. <laughs> mm -mm, no. Thank you, Felicia. And I don't think anybody needs to know that you're gonna give me off all next week now, with pay. Now, Felicia, that's a bit much. I'm Baby, not... I really can't wait any longer. You said with pay? Off? Mm -hmm. You got it. Um, enjoy your Thank vacation. You. Thank you. I'm all set. Great. Thanks for the pictures. No problem. Hey, Bill. I am liking your style, buddy. Selfie? You, no, we're not doing this. Smile. Adam right, Cowboy. Right, I'm Cowboy. Well, honey, saddle up. Big Daddy's coming. Bam, bada, bam, bada, bam, bada, bam, bonanza. Woo! Next case. Doyle versus Hart. Mr. Doyle, Ms. Hart, and uh, you are? Counselor for the defense. 
Your Honor. But you can call me Richard. Richard, yes. Small claims court. Not necessary. And uh, I'd appreciate your silence. Miss Hart, Mr. Doyle is suing you for the monetary losses of his catering job. He is seeking the amount of $1,300. Mr. Doyle, who is seeking the settlement, claims that Miss Hart has soiled his cooking arrangement. And because of her careless action and disregard, he has lost his employment. Is this correct, Miss Hart? Objection. Sit down. Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Doyle, do you have anything to present to the court? <clears throat> Your Honor, Miss Hart's actions not only cost me my paying job, but also my reputation because of Miss Hart's reckless negligence. I'm now being hassled by my landlady because I can't make rent and I can't find another job despite previous glowing recommendations. Yeah. In Miss Hart's defense, what do you say to claims that the food at that time was putrid, vulgar, yeah. infected, and jank? Yes, Your Honor, it was most definitely jank. Excuse me, jank. Your Honor, but I can assure you that the quality of these dishes was the highest as it always is. I've brought a sample of the haggis in question to present to you as evidence. Really? Don't mind if I do. You know, uh, I'm a cook myself. I've been known to make a mean cheesecake. Oh, really? <laughs> um, I love to bake. I have a strawberry recipe, but I can never get the consistency just right. The top's always cracked. Ah, well, uh, when there's too much air um, entrained, uh, we want to avoid um, it. We can discuss this uh, later. Okay, then. <clears throat> Carl, we'll take a short recess. One clue down. Here's the next one. Lions and tigers and bears, oh my, but that's not all. Do you know why? Science lives here with more surprises inside. The Academy of Natural Wait, Sciences. Oh. No, 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 no. The Academy of Natural Sciences. The Academy of Natural Sciences. is the answer. Dan, nice answer. Where'd you park the car? It should be right here. The science is no parking, Dean. He said it was free parking. <laughs> it is on weekends, so... It's Tuesday, you idiot! Tuesday? What is wrong with you? Know. Richard is going to kill oh. me! Haley? I am going to, going to kill Haley. you! What is wrong with you? Okay, okay. 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 Break, break it up. Break it up. Nick, take Dean, go get the car. I'll take care of Haley. Well, I think you guys need Nick, me. Nick, you heard the man. Let's go get the car. Come on. Who are you calling a man? Uh, it's good. Get him. But I think she's coming. Oh, Haley, I'm stop. kidding! Oh, Haley! Oh, Haley. Oh, Haley. Hello? Hey, Kyle, you there? So there. Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm baking. What are you doing? <laughs> I've been in court all day, dude. Remember? They uh, just let us out on recess. I think the judge really likes me. Uh, I think we're gonna win. Finally make some money. Get paid. Dude, I'm really proud of you. Um... Yeah, just let me know how it goes. All right, I'll see you when you get back. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. You, you, you called me five times, dude. What's up? I did? Yeah, you did. Oh, I did, I did. Um... Yeah, the budger called and he said the meat was off. Off? What does that mean? Bad. <sighs> like how bad? Like last episode of Seinfeld, bad. Do you want to go out later? Oh, come on! I think we just need to get the car and get out of here. Uh, relax, the impound lot's right here. I'm just starving, are you hungry? Are you kidding? How could you think about food at a time like this? Uh, uh, Claire's gonna go to jail tomorrow, probably. We lost the car and Haley's freaking out. But I am kinda hungry. Hi there. 189.95 plus tax, cash only. You know what? We'll give you this plastic right here with my name on it. You just swipe it through your iPhone and we'll be on our way. Cash only. Okay, well, we'll be right back. Um, where can we find an ATM? There's a club down there. Hang a left through the lot. You'll see it. Okay. Thank you, Billy. What? 
Aren't you the guy that works at the impound lot? Do I look like I work at an impound lot? No, no. no. <laughs> uh, well, is there an ATM inside we could use? Yeah, there's an ATM. We're a strip club. So why don't you go ahead in and I'll wait out here. Cool, cool, cool. Well, Claire well, does not know, will not hurt her. I mean, she may be in jail tomorrow. Well, lift it up. Plus, they have free tacos. You said you were hungry, right? I do love tacos. <laughs> okay, yeah. let's do it. All right. Oh, we're just gonna go inside and use the ATM. Oh, hold on there, James Dean. $15 cover charge, cash. Uh, look, my friend here, he's going to prison tomorrow. I killed a guy with a shoe. All right, kids, come on around back. Party's around back. It was a long walk. I can't believe Dean got the car towed. Oh. We're already running so behind. He's an idiot. So, uh, what are we doing here? We are taking oh. photos of Ben Franklin's tumor. Ew! What? Cool, right? No! Yeah. Oh. Okay, so, all right, what do we have to do? Do we have to pay uh, for something? Follow my lead. May I help you? We are here on official museum business. This is my assistant. The court has been presented with evidence that very nearly replicates the dish in question, which was present at the incident. Is that correct, Mr. Doyle? Uh, yes, Your Honor. Um, but on further reflection, I don't think it uh, fairly uh, represents me as a chef. I cannot make an informed decision unless I sample the dish in question. Of course, Your Honor, but I mean, it must be cold, Bernard. Unless you wish to withdraw your case entirely, Mr. Doyle. Do you wish to withdraw, Mr. Doyle? Bearing in mind that you are liable for significant court costs. Very significant. Yes, Your Honor. <clears throat> Very well. Case dismissed. Jank, jank. Miss Hart. Sorry. See the court clerk on the way out to discuss payment arrangements. Thank you very much, Your Honor. It was a pleasure. Go home. See how... Yes, Your Honor. Sorry, ladies, but I don't think official museum business involves taking pictures and touching bones. I told you to turn off the flash. I don't know how to turn off the flash. Then you should have let me take the pictures. Well, what does it matter? We're going to lose anyway. Oh, you're going to lose. I'm going to win. Oh, you're going to win? Yes, I'm <coughs> going to win. Ladies, are you done yet? Where have you been? It's a long story. We went to a strip club. I didn't like it. Very funny, Nick. Let's go. <sighs> See you guys, pretty sure it's over. Just because nobody's here doesn't mean it's over. It's over. No, no, there has to be something. Well, if there is, we'll find it. Isn't there something right here? Found it! What? Let's see. To the person in last place. I can't believe we wasted a whole day on this for nothing. So, wait, what does that mean? You don't get to go to the medical expo? No. And I don't get to shadow Dr. Terman, which could have landed me a full-time position in the hospital. Oh, well, I mean, it was just a stupid scavenger hunt. What does it even mean? Well, it's not a total loss. He did include a punch card to Mac Shack. And went out for mac and cheese. Yeah, and we saw a lot of cool stuff around the city. I mean, I've never seen half these places and we live here. He has a point. And I did have a little bit of fun today. And I got a whole week's paid vacation. And you're doing my laundry and picking up my dry cleaning and bringing me breakfast in bed. Okay, okay, at least somebody won something today. <laughs> so, drinks? Yeah. I'm down for drinks. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. So what do you guys want to do about the car? Dean? So how about that, huh? Won my first big case, you don't have to pay a dime, and plus, I look real good in this suit. Not a bad day, huh? I don't know, I still feel weird about the whole thing. 
You know you have to press a button to make the elevator work, right? <clears throat> Look, the meat was spoiled, okay? Can we just drop it? What? The butcher called and said the meat was bad. Oh, so you were just gonna let the judge have some bad no, meat? No, I stopped her from trying it, remember? So why did Claire get sick? Yeah, why did I get sick? Because she has bad taste. Oh, no, no, no! Hold the elevator! Your Honor. Mr. Doyle, <clears throat> Brian, I have a confession to make. What do you mean? During the recess, I took a few bites of the haggis. I had never had haggis before. I had to try it. Mm, um, there's something you should know about. No, it's very good. It had a touch of nutmeg in it, and and something else. Um, it had another ma um, herb. I think. No, 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 no. Don't tell me. Let me try Here, this. Honor, I really I... know it was. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, it had some, I think it was a, uh... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think we'll catch the next one. <laughs> Stairs? Yeah, I need to walk. I need to walk, oh, too. Sorry you guys didn't win today. It's okay. I know Claire really needed your help, so... At least you had my car. Oh, yeah, Richard, um, sorry about your car. What? Um, I mean, it was really great that we had your car because you did it, I mean, it really helped out, and it was... I told you that I love you today. I, because I do, I... Hey, guys, uh, this is Brian. Boo! Hey, hey, easy. You got some kind of nerve coming over here. No, 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 it's okay, guys. We hashed it out. We're cool. Brian is cool. <laughs> Brian's cool, guys. Brian. <laughs> I'm cool. So I'm, I can be I'm cool. I'm sorry about all this, guys. Um, you know what? I'll buy you all a round of drinks. How's that? You are cool. I like <laughs> And you know what? I can cook for you, too. Um, I'll, I'll cook a mean tripe. <laughs> all right. Chitrilly, chitrilly.